right back. Sorry, I didn't want to be on a YouTube video or anything, so I just left. You're still on probation, is that correct? Uh, yes, why are you asking me about my probation status when I came in to follow you? Because course. you're still on probation, so I'm going to make sure that you don't have any weapons on you, given that you're a violent individual who's assaulted with weapons in the past. No, I haven't. You're full of it. You're on probation. Right, but to attack me while violating my rights. Um, no, part of the terms of your probation, you signed that you agreed You're welcome to go back to being an inmate if you don't want to consent to probation search. But All you need to do is go and check in with the judge or the probation me, department, sir. Uh, to restrict me from recording the violation of my rights. I mean, no one's restricting you, 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 you from recording anything. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm just making sure you don't have any weapons given that you've assaulted people with a baseball bat in the past. You, you mean have the dude that tried to, to kill me for being a faggot and pulled a knife on me and said he was going to cut me to ribbons? There's no reason to use that kind of language. I'm quoting my assailant. Why are you taking papers out of my pocket? You can't take papers. Because you're subject to search and seizure. I can remove whatever I want from you. Uh, if but, you have a problem with that, you can contact the probation you department. You can't leave my hand to the sheriff's department for the remainder of your custody. You, you can't end the conversation. You can't, um... Let's go ahead. Are you good to go outside there? Uh, don't yep. touch my let's head outside. Let's stay here. Yeah, I like to head. Don't touch my shit. This is also going to be search and seizure as well. Right, we'll search it. But go let's go outside so we can search the seizure. Nope. Go outside. I like more witnesses. Why are you, you all grabbing my things? Search it and then be done with this. Go outside. Be careful with that. It's open. Go ahead. We're going to go outside so that this gentleman can proceed forward with whatever his business is. I am we can assist you with whatever you need assistance with. What can I assist you with today, Mr. Wood? Uh, California Code 653. I have five, three. new violations. Okay, be careful with my shit. This is expensive. Where's my phone? California Penal Code 653. Yeah, I gotta pull up. One moment. And so no one told me I couldn't record. Uh, okay, I'm tripping. I'm tri uh, I must be hearing things. <clears throat> California Penal Code Section 653M, a knowing phone call. Definition, elements of the crime. In the last decade, cell phones and other personal communication devices have become fixtures for a large majority of the population. However, this increased accessibility can make a person susceptible to abuse. And these devices may be used as a means to annoy, pester, or harass others. As a result, it is against the law to make annoying phone calls in the California Penal Code Section 653M. This statute applies to phone calls, text messages, and other methods of electronic communication. To prove the defendant is guilty of making annoying phone calls, the prosecutor must establish the following facts. Facts. One, the defendant may contact via telephone or electronic communication, which can include text messages, emails, faxes, instant messages, any other form of electronic communication. Number two, calls or messages were obscene, threatening, or repeated. And three, uh, the defendant did this with the intent to annoy. Okay? Now, you're aware I've reported this several times in the past, meaning, yes, it is repetitive. And I also have video showing you guys that, um, that they claim that their purpose is to cause as much emotional pain and suffering as possible. That's their stated purpose. They, they, they've got a, a, a vlogs about it. What do you do? What do you know? I thought we were done with the search part. You're also playing my expensive stuff. I'm not playing with anything. I'm just searching your property. You're on yeah, the basis. We're allowed to search your stuff. Yeah, yeah. Because you all fucking failed to do something about the violent felon that kept threatening me, and I had to fight for my life. I mean, you hid the exculpatory evidence. Don't drop that. I believe the judge made a decision in that matter. So uh, take your issue up with the judge. Yeah, yeah, but thanks to the scandal's public defender hiding exculpatory evidence. Again, you can take that matter with the judge. 
All right. What did you need to complain about? I'm sorry. The violation of the penal code that I just clearly outlined has been violated. The man has sent me millions of messages over a period of seven years. He sent me one yesterday. Okay. It's a clear violation of this penal code. Where did he send me a message at? Where did he send me a message at? Here, let me pull it up. What means of communication was it? Um, uh, let me quote back from... Uh, any other form of electronic communication, a YouTube comment, on my channel, talking to another channel. Not, eh, eh. It's a message directly to me. It doesn't meet the elements. It doesn't meet the elements. It doesn't meet the elements. Hold on, you're, you're, you're talking about a comment on a public forum. That no, you on choose, my channel. That you choose to log into. On my channel, that it's a violation of the penal code. It doesn't meet the, it doesn't meet the elements. You're welcome to file a complaint with the Sheriff's Department if you like. I'm not taking a report for you. Doesn't make the elements. Okay. What's your name and badge number? J Gox, eight six nine nine. You. Liberty D White. And you're refusing to take the report as well. Yes, because like my partner says, it does okay. not meet the elements. All right. Well, I'm gonna go in here and just sit for a while and play with my phone. So whatever. Doesn't meet the elements. Well, how doesn't it meet the elements? How does a million fucking messages about possum fucking and dog fucking and children fucking not meet the mess the fucking elements? It's a public forum. It's not my fucking channel. It's on a public forum. I have threatened to burn a pile of children alive in front of their parents if they don't stop messaging me. He's banned. He's restricted. He keeps making new accounts to circumvent the banning. Over and over, every day for seven years. You don't have to YouTube have a YouTube forum. account. You can contact YouTube. You can definitely make a contact. Yeah, yeah, yeah. YouTube. They do, and their fucking final word is contact the police. It's a violation of the penal code. Me no. civilly suing one of the biggest corporations on earth isn't necessary. It's harassing messages. Just because someone at YouTube doesn't want to deal with your phone. I got something on my phone. I'm going to sit in here and relax. You know what he told me? He said that you never told me I couldn't record. You never said that, right? I just said you can't record. You did, he, he just said you didn't. I don't know, I was Oh, well, he says you never said that. It would be illegal if you did that. Go fuck yourself. What's your name? Who are you? Identify yourself. I'm officer. Officer? An officer? You're, you're not just the secretary or something. You're a police officer. But your title is officer. Community service officer. Okay, community service officer. That is clearly covered by the Ninth Circuit decision to expressly allow the interaction, to the recording of the interactions between law enforcement officers and civilians. Well, tough luck. It ain't your fucking lobby, it's the people's lobby, fat fuck. You're not the lobby to report. Get fucked. Do something. Go ahead and call the dude that said you never said that in here. Y'all heard it. He says he never said that. Now I got shit to do on my phone. I got a stalker out there. Look at you realize that we are a few hundred yards from where the stalker last approached me. For all I know, he's out there watching. Hold on, you know what? Let me pull up his shit. I don't know who it's Stefano, you know, but he's not using that one right now. He's using the salt of the rain. Uh, Jesus. 
was crying over an American flag 18 or 10 hours ago. Please stop the internet harassment, he says the fucking troll has been harassing you for years and years. Welcome back to the Salty Rant. So today is an update video for all my peeps. Everyone that subscribed to me, good, like-minded citizens, law-abiding citizens. As a Christian, we will be persecuted. The guys and gals that want to get under our skin. As it is, and Say shall be written, our reward await us in heaven. Great thing you want to hear from a stalker. Just to give a little shit about dying with your reward, right? Uh, I've decided to change my platform. I've decided to change my life. There was a lady that I didn't get along with on the internet. From she the told me that she recently had found God. She was hoping that I would find the same happiness that she found. I don't know if it's exactly the same, but I have found it. She was hoping that I would find the same happiness that she found. I don't know if it's exactly the same. So you said that you made this 18 hours ago in the bowel. I have found What time is it? And I'm much more mm. secure. Right about the time you sent me that message. No right, 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 right. It doesn't really amount to a whole lot. Obviously, you know, being a nice person and doing nice things for people and helping those people in need, that shows that you're a good person. But really, there's no such thing as a good person in heaven. So I've been told and led to believe. I'm still a work in progress, but I'm Did giving up my life that? to Christ just because I can say it doesn't mean I should do it or say it. Um, I don't know if that makes any sense to anybody. There's a lot of people that want to see me fail and they want to. Yeah, I just want to never hear from you again. But you can't go a day without fucking sending me perverted messages. And here's this dude that's supposedly dead. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to Selfie Brand. Today, I share with you a friend who passed three years ago. He was on the. Uh, Is your friend good riddance? Why don't you just go to my photos and pull up? Nope, <laughs> so I was convenient. Right there. So this is on my channel, not a public forum, but my channel, Lou Stefano has been banned repeatedly. And I, I, I've blocked his accounts repeatedly, hundreds and hundreds of times for seven years. But here they are on my channel. Oh, oh, I blocked it there. No, it was another one, another one, another one. Uh, hold up. So he's not on a public forum, he's on my channel. They're talking about criminal cases. They had inside of insider information about Coulter Smallwood. So is this meant to harass and annoy? Is this repeated communication? Well, he sent me a million messages. Okay, Mr. Wood. Um so you change your mind? No. Um, because look at you, you're going to say that's not harassing and annoying messages. So you choose to log into that forum that's owned by YouTube and engage in conversation. Actually, this is on my I'm not going to argue with you about it. Facebook um, and YouTube. You can file a complaint with the Sheriff's Department if you don't agree. Um, okay. The other issue here is, is that this is a lobby where people conduct police and official. Right. And the Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals there are has individuals ruled. out there who have left the lobby based on you coming in here and filming them and creating a disturbance. I'm not creating a disturbance, I'm filing a report. So I'm going to admonish you at this point that if you don't leave the lobby, you're going to be arrested. Well, I have to leave you, huh? Okay. And again, if you have an Under issue with that, arrest, you can take it up with the sheriff. Yeah, 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 I got you. Mom. So you said that, I didn't know. Your official business is done here. 
Well, I was still collecting evidence and looking at them. Like I said, I was busy. What I'm evidence? a golfer out there. Maybe I feel safe in the police. I don't want to right interfere now. with your own personal investigation. What evidence do you have to collect inside the lobby? Or looking at my phone. I was okay. trying to you do, do that. You, 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 I put the you can do that outside. You can do that outside, right? Yeah. Thank you. Clearly, that I would leave. Okay, go ahead. I'll go for it. important to hide well, their interaction. You can't be recording them as they're going in to do their regular business. Now you're telling me I can't record outside? Fuck you. Colton, seriously, you've been totally normal and fine other times. How about we resort to that? You're telling me that I don't have the right to record in the parking lot of my local sheriff's department. What the fuck is wrong with what, you, you oath-breaking bigot? Want? What do they want? You said that you're making no, 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 I got you. My recording is me exercising my just, constitutionally protected rights, making them uncomfortable. You just can't film inside the lobby. Yeah, when, when those individuals, the lobby, when people in there that are trying no, to. No, no, she just said I can't film out here, people going and coming. No, she didn't. She explained to you. She didn't that. say all that. Yeah, but. Just get over it. Just get over it. Yeah, what rather, comes out of your mouth can't be trusted. I'm familiar leave. with that. I'd rather you leave, but. I'm outside. What the fuck here. are you doing now? You're just. You could sit here. Yeah. Well, I feel like playing with my phone for a while. I can't do that while I'm driving, so. And I feel safe here. Like, a, what if my stalker walks up to me and sits down in front of me again? Did you know what happened? Like, right over there. And it's that dude I'm complaining about. Remember that? I was completely unaware that he spent all day stalking me. He was live streaming it. I didn't know. I'm sitting there working on my computer and he sits down right next to me. That, that, that's the only, and no warning. Just, oh, there's my stalker. Oh. I was filing a report for Penal Code 653, harassing messages. So Mr. Mr. Wood has a YouTube page that is owned by YouTube. It's no, it's YouTube. owned by me. It is me. my page. Excuse me, sir. Um, so there are individuals that react to his videos and his posts, which are provocative. He's lying about the public forum. It's my channel. I control that, and I have banned Luke Stefano. I have banned a hundred accounts from Luke Stefano, and he keeps making new accounts to circumvent banning. So he posts a video to provoke a response from individuals who then respond to his video who want to speak. The video was of me saying, hey, stalkers, I got money now. Leave me the fuck alone, or it's going to cause you problems. So, of course, they well, talk example, about like. The last one that you told me, which was that you posted a video talking about what, shooting up a school or owning or burning people or something like that, and then people posted comments Yes, I threatened to, to burn a pile of children alive in front of their parents, report. letting them know that it was because the police and refused so to take action about the Nazi qualify. pedophiles that formed a argument. domestic it terror organization called the Cobra Gay Mafia. What the fuck happened to this? It doesn't qualify, sir. We can't post it. Doesn't meet the elements. They've done that. I've got a million messages from this guy. I've got a million direct emails from him. One of which said that Richard Crow, Megan Saul, pedophile's family member who's a cop, came to his house and put a gun to his wife's head to tell him to shut the fuck up that he couldn't talk. I don't want to hear that. I don't want to hear about a dirty cop fucking um, threatening to kill someone's wife. He sent me that email. It wasn't a message on Facebook. It was a direct message to me. You know how many messages I've got from this guy over the past years? He uses every form of harassment. He used a robot dialer to call my phone tens of thousands of times. Back in the day, in 2015, 2016, 2017, I have multi-hour videos just sitting there, just decline call, decline call, decline call, Based decline call, decline, decline call, decline. You decline. All of those incidents to other police departments. Yeah. And you didn't well, not all of them. You can't cover all of them. There are too many, but I did what I could. Okay. And I made a sincere that effort. Torrance police department. 
apartment. Yes, Torrance was where I lived during, and I moved Riverside here. Sheriff's Department, Police Department. <laughs> Riverside's where this dude lives, yep. So, so let, me, let me clarify for you. The incidents that you're referencing that happened in those jurisdictions, you reported those incidents to a police department. Well, I live here now, and he's still harassing me. So yes, he harassed me for seven years, so he harassed me before I moved here in other places, but he's still harassing me. He's going to continue harassing me. We aren't going to document something that you already reported to another agency. So no matter how much he continues to harass me, you're not going to document it. You have to remember, again, when it comes to things like Facebook and YouTube, those are covered under, those fall under the First Amendment, right? People have a right to freedom of speech. No different than you have a right to your freedom of speech when we dealt with you before, right? So you Actually, you violated my, you, just, you are you. violating my First Amendment right now. No, we're not. Freedom of the press. Couldn't record inside the sheriff's station. Uh, you can't record other individuals who are here conducting personal law enforcement business. That's a violation of my rights. No, it's no. not, sir. It's yes, not. it is. Because you don't have to be in there. And what happened to your story? Because earlier you said no one said that. And I, I conceded, like, oh, maybe I was hallucinating. Maybe, no maybe. One said what? Sorry. You said that no one told me I couldn't record. We didn't tell you you couldn't record. Neither one of us told you you couldn't record. Maybe the other dude me. did, and you denied he said it. We weren't here. I don't know what that So how do we know what conversation you we had? you have a complaint to file, reference that gentleman, feel free to do so. My issue is, is that there are individuals who come into this lobby to conduct police business. They left the lobby, came out here and told us that they don't feel comfortable conducting police business inside the lobby because you're reporting them you're creating a disturbance. So right. they're butt hurt from my recording and I lose my constitutionally protected rights because of it. You don't they're have a right constitutionally to to protected right to go inside and stay in the lobby and record. And record. Else oh, well, that. that's not what the, the jurisdiction we're in said. The appellate court made it clear that I do have so that right. A civil lawsuit, yeah, yeah. Take on a very rich municipality and the I homeless man's got to sue. If you don't like the rules... Then Those aren't the rules. The rules the are I have a constitutionally protected right to record my interaction with law enforcement. I came to my local sheriff's department. I think you all are corrupt with what you're doing. I want to document our interaction. Because people because I've run into a situation many times in the future where you just lie and say, I never said that. We're documenting it as well. Thank goodness. These Please keep those. Please, I, I, I fully support that. I'm glad I do too. Yeah. So uh, I have nothing nothing here to hide. We're not we're not stopping you from being here in the parking lot, okay? You're stopping me from filming in the lobby. That's a violation. Correct. We are stopping you from filming in the lobby right now because there are other individuals inside the lobby who are conducting police business. And throughout the day, there will be other individuals that continue to access the lobby. And we don't want to dissuade those individuals from contacting the sheriff's department as they have a legal and lawful right to do. But you will dissuade me. We will dissuade you and prevent you from preventing them from being able How am to I preventing business. them? How is my First Amendment freedom of the press preventing them from doing anything? This is a matter that you can take up with the court or the sheriff's department if you don't agree with what we're doing here right now. Okay, I will. I encourage you. Mm -hmm. All right, now back to the stalkers. Um, when they told me that they were going to come, when the sun goes down, they're going to come with a group of men and rape me and then feed me my own shit off their bloody cucks. Uh, what about that criminal threats? And what about the stalking statue? Both of these are related, and they've done both many, 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 many times. More than I can count. How do you justify that? Someone who's been convicted of rape telling me that he's going to rape me and then feed me my own shit off his bloody cock. How do you defend that? How do you prove that that happened? I got the emails. I still have them. Do you understand how many tens of thousands of messages I have saved? And when did you report those? That would have been 2017. Okay. And what was the outcome of your report? Uh, I for there was I was dealing with the Rampart L L.A. Police Station, and I was staying okay. in a shelter. I'll stop I just you right there. go ahead and contact the Los Angeles Police Department and find out what the outcome of your report. He blocked my email when I forwarded that message to him. Problem. He's like, "I'm not listening to this anymore. I'm blocked." Not, it. Our deal. not my problem. Okay, that's but the same dude is still harassing me. The same dude messaged me last night. And that's also the same dude that physically approached me over here. Remember that? How he came and just sat down in front of me like, oh, here's my stalker. And it turns out he'd been live streaming, stalking me all day, and I was completely unaware until he sat down right in front of me. 
And you have that recorded on yes. video that yes. you sat down next to? Yes. Do you have that video? Yes, I do. Want to see it? Sure. Go. Cool.